or blue and red. I I don't I don't know. It's like Team Fortress 2 Halo stuff. Hello, you imbeciles. It's me, Shadow the Hedgehog. Welcome back to another. What's it called again? Sonic does a review. Today, since when it's Christmas, we will be doing a review on this movie he likes so much called Klaus. For some reason, it's called Klaus, even though it should be Claus. But who really cares, honestly? Does anyone care? No one. If you do, you are a complete idiot. Alright, so. First off, he wanted he wanted me to say that it's a really good movie and the production of it took five years to make and all that. But I don't really care about the production because I'm an edgy edge lord. So let's I'm just reading this off the script. He had to do some stuff. I'm just gonna do what a substitute does and just do what they do, but just really don't give two craps about what other people think or something. I don't know. So, the plot, he said, was about this male guy. He was kind of like Cusco from... Wait, yeah, from Cusco. I don't know his name. From the the Emperor's New Groove. The Emperor from the Emperor's New Groove. Kind of like that. You know, um, like, he acts spoiled, and he's rich, and all that. And he, he fails his stuff and all that. So, yeah, he's training to become a postman or a mailman or s some dumb some dumb stuff like that and um what else do you want me to say tails oh yeah and um he said to, to him that um that he was put in um uh, in smearsburg all right so he was being like spoiled and all that so his dad put him all the way to smearsburg which is an island far away Really far away, I think. I don't know. And, um... I gotta fix these pillows. And, um... Also... He said that... I don't know. There's this cute character. Um... What are, what's her name again? He didn't tell me, so I don't... I, I don't know his name. Well, that's completely pointless. So, we just wanted to say that there's this cute character. Uh, an image right here. For post... Im, post... Edit Sonic. You better come back, cause I'm sick and tired of naming, name trying to name all these characters. So yeah, wait, what's the mailman, mail, mailman's guy, the uh, mailman's name again? Well, we don't know his official name, but uh, this little, the little girl that he likes, not not a pervert, not in a pervert way, but like in a cute way. It, it's in, it's in the movie. Uh, she calls him Chespin, so just call him that. So Chespin, and um, yeah, so he goes to Smearingsburg. He's like. Oh, this 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 place is crappy, and this boat guy is like, follow me. He, he makes him ring the bell, on purpose. I mean, not on purpose, on accident. I wish it was on purpose. That fight would have had a reason. So it's a fighting, it's a fight bell, because there's these things called, I think they're called crossbows and the Elling bow. So they're they're like they've been in war for many years, and they 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 try to kill each other basically. And an old lady throws berries at a, a blanket and all that it, 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 it's just part of, it's it's like it's black and red okay or blue and red i i don't i don't know it's like team fortress 2 halo stuff <laughs> so yeah and that's what happened and um so this mailman tries to go but the he rang the war bell which why have why why do you have a war bell you should call it the edge bell maybe you have guns in it to make it a real war. And then that would, that would have really made my day. So, um, yeah, he rings a war bell. He goes into the school. And this lady, I'm just going to call her Miss Teacher. So, Miss Teacher is, um, like, a little hunter. She just she sells fish because he wants to go out of town, uh, out of this place. Because the, they didn't let their kids go to school for some reason. I don't freaking know. And, um, so she's trying to move away. And he's like, what happened? He's like, the thing is, this is it all that. She graduated college and all that. She was completely, she was a nice person until this, she moved to Smearingsburg or something. So after that, uh, what happened after that? 
Oh yeah, Sonic wanted me to, okay, so I just, me and Sonic and Tails noticed this, but there's this old lady, and she's kind of like the queen of the Ellenbos, I think, I don't know, the, the, uh, the, the red side, no, the blue side, the dark blue side, which I kind of like that side, and she said she sounds like Jesse. me, um, Sonic and Tails have noticed this, and it's the voice actor, it's just the same voice actor, honestly, Woody out of nowhere just, <laughs> it was like, uh, Jesse, uh, you say it. I, I completely, like, I completely forgot what happened, Tails. So what happened is Woody jumped and said Jesse and just started smashing up the the place all all over the ground. So, yeah, um, they're not in love, cause you know who ships Jesse and Woody. If you do, you are stupid. So, yeah, that's what happened. So, yeah, it sounds like Jesse. So, oh. Uh, so, he runs away to this place where this, where Santa Claus, where, where I'm just gonna call him Klaus, because I don't really care anymore. I hate the fat, jolly guy. So, he finds this place, and he's really threatened, because he's, like, a woodsman or something. He breaks stuff, but he, he entered inside us up. Breaking and entering, he finds a whole bunch of toys. Oh, wait, no. Bef no, the reason why he was running is because... I don't Tails, can you please do this, please? I I don't I don't wanna do this, Tails, please. Please. Look, I'll I'll do I'll I'll do the the part where he talks about the plot, and then you could do the other part, okay? So after they rang the doorbell, we're starting this all over, where they where he rang the doorbell after it. Uh Justy and all that showed up. Look who finally chicken out and so he goes and saw well yeah. He goes and like he's like who's who who rang the bell, and then this these I I thought they're brothers and sisters for a second, like but they're completely separate people. So she has a boy and he has a girl, and they're like both like mine. So yeah, and one of, and the girl and the girl and the boy fight with this with the mailman with Chespin, um and they're like uh oh, look at me and then the girl wins and is like. So, it's like a brother and sister, but they're not brother and sister, because at the end, spoilers, they marry. So, uh, yeah, that'll be, that'll be very weird. Oh, my God. So, yeah, the plot is it's still good. And, yeah, it, and then just been, you know, in, in the future, he starts liking the town, but then he, he, like, uh, they find out the plot, like, what he's doing, the, the evil guys, and then they, like, mail him a whole bunch of papers because his, his he's try he was trying to reach six thousand until he got really used to the town town and like Klaus got popular and every kid was being nice to everyone everyone was being nice to everyone and then there's no uh um a war bell there was a nice bell so yeah no one no, no one likes that bell i like the one with war i want guns in that one next time I ignore him he's trying to be edgy so yeah uh, and also, he said his opinions, his opinions were, is this is the greatest movie, he said he can't believe it took five years to make, and also, he said the cute, the, the characters are so loving, and you get used to them, and they have, you know, character arc and all that, it, it, it's, he said it was a really good movie, and that's what I think as well, because I just watched it. And it, it's a really good movie for what it was. The production. Some people who made Cusco's New Groove and uh, Krunk's New Groove and all that. They actually worked on this movie. So, yeah. And they actually, like, did, like, 3D modeling. But, like, art. Like, that's pretty cool. Alright, you do you do the other stuff. What other stuff is there? What other stuff is there to do? Like, you already gave, told him his opinions. Tell him your opinion. Oh, well, I like to do that. Uh, I think it's stupid, dumb, gay, and dumb. Wow. I think only five words explained how you feel about your life. You know what I'm going to feel of your life? Death. Get over here! <laughs> I don't like you. So, yeah, I, I guess it's a good movie, I guess. I don't really care. Also, yeah, this is supposed to be a Christmas. As you can see, 
a plush collection will be soon. Um, Sonic told me that, unfortunately, this interview with Woody, Woody's interview will be, uh, Woody's interview, uh, Coyote Mario will be cancelled, unfortunately, because the old tablet sucked. This phone is completely better. Okay, it's better in quality, okay? Smug Thug or someone or something, someone or something, I don't know, someone who's a fan of the show, um, do a comparison uh, which is of, uh, you know, a side, a comparison of the one where I did on the, on the tap. Shut up. I'm trying to make a bio here. So, yeah, Merry Christmas today, because it's probably like 12 already, so we probably won't even get this video out, so, Yeah. Where is Sonic? Like, where is he, by the way? Oh, he, he had to visit his old family, like, you know, the brothers from Sonic Underground. <laughs> Even though that show kind of sucks, but, I mean, who cares, honestly? From, you know, uh, what were their names again? Manic and Sydney or something? And his mom. So, he had to meet his mom and all that. Where's Knuckles? Boxing. That's pretty, com um, that's pretty, uh, predictable, so... Like and subscribe. I don't care. Do whatever you want to do. Do you th do you think I give two craps? No, I don't, cause I'm edgy. Also, I have this stupid hat. <clears throat> okay. <sighs> <sighs> Merry Christmas, everyone. Like and subscribe. Q and A will be blah, blah. I think we were just trying to say Q and A will be due in February. It will have the Sonic Amiibo, the Sonic games. For one reason and one reason only, Sonic movie. It's going to come out in February, so we are probably going to do it before the Sonic movie will be uh, on theaters. Uh, me, uh, no, not me, Sonic, um, Plush Play, and uh, uh, Little Cranberry Soda, who's in our Discord server, will be joining him and watching the movie. They're not, like, out of town, like... They're not far away from each other. They're just close. They're they're really close. They're like miles away and blocks away. So, well, they're not miles. They're like a couple of blocks. Yeah. So, like and subscribe. I don't care. Give, give a crap. Tell us hopes that this gets out before eleven. So yeah. I'm an edgy lord. So don't mess with me, punks. Any of you nerds want to fight me in Smash Brothers? Just you wait, boomers. I'm gonna. I'm a total Sonic fan. Wait, what is that? 